Good morning. It is a Sunday morning and we are in Alabama. We are back in Maplesville, Alabama or around there. And we are getting ready to do the, I believe the 50th annual Gobbler Getter Enduro. So we're back at the Gobbler Getter yet again. Last year, if you remember, I ran out of gas at the Gobbler Getter because I'm not a smart man. This year I have gas, but my battery is giving me a lot of heartache and it seems to not want to be good. So I've been able to throw a charge on it. I'm pretty sure she's going to start. I might, uh, I'm going to travel with me today with a battery starter just in case I get out there and it doesn't want to start. I got a jump start battery thing. But anyway, so we're here. We got in last night. We have five of us this time, kind of a small crew. So we've got uh, Mac and Frank and Chris and Dalton. Dalton was on row 57, I believe, so he's already taken off. We are on row 103, so we don't take off for another hour or so. And we're kind of just hanging out this morning. We got up early, went to Waffle House, got some breakfast, um, just kind of slowly get, making our way. Because we're out of Florida, so it's an hour different, which gives us kind of an extra hour here to kind of wake up in the morning. So what says six o'clock really is five o'clock, or five o'clock is six o'clock, whatever that thing is. Anyway, we're here. Um, Mac is on row 101 and I'm on row 103. So I'm going to try to chase Mac down. We have kind of a small bet going that I can do it. Really don't know if I can do it or not. I doubt it. It's two minutes is a long time, especially for me. Um, but I'm going to give that a shot. And then uh, got a beer bet on that for tonight's dinner. But we're just kind of hanging out here. You guys have seen the Perry Mountain area before, i.e. a parking lot, right? It's kind of a big area. There's two sections, this section, another section way over there you can't see. This is the same spot that we did the 24-hour race at, right? So the 24-hour race we had last year, same exact spot. We're almost in the same parking area. Beautiful land. It's been dry, so it's going to be dusty, they say. And that's about it. I mean, this one's going to be... Uh... Now, I will say this. We, we're doing this race in lieu of a hair scramble. So for whatever reason, Perry Mountain Motorcycle Club, which I'm a huge fan of, they scheduled this race effectively a week earlier than they normally would, right? So it's called the Gobbler Getter. The, uh, you know, November Gobbler Getter slash Thanksgiving should be in November race. Typically is the first week of November. Arguably, this is the end of October, right? Arguably because October 31st is like Tuesday. So by scheduling this race on this weekend, it caused conflict with our FTR schedule for a hair scramble down in, uh, oh, I don't know where it was at, somewhere down there in Florida. So. Half our team is at the hair scramble. Half the team is here doing this, doing the enduro. I prefer enduros over hair scrambles. I don't know, I just have more fun at the enduros. So that is one of the big reasons. It is the reason why we are a split team right now and we are separate. Um, but outside of that, I don't know why they did that. I mean, I hope they don't do it again next year because it, it's a conflict of, of schedule. We like to run both if we can. And this is a sanctioned FTR event too. So. You know, you have an, an enduro versus hair scramble. Some guys are purists on enduro. Some guys are purists on hair scrambles. Whatever. I just like to go out here and ride and have fun. All right, so we still have about an hour, but, you know, guys like Mac here are getting ready. Yeah, baby! Woo! <laughs> and Christopher over there. See? Ready to go. My mountain man, Christopher. Frank is over here hanging out and helping, uh, helping some guy get his bike ready to go. Don't know who he is, but he's on row 50, and the time now is... 954 so he's already four minutes late so sorry but they helped him get his bike going looks like he's getting his clothes on he's ready to roll stan is here with us stan actually helped uh watch our bikes last night thumb gas is over there getting his gear together so we got a bunch of ftr above us out here up here in perry mountain it's a good time all right gonna hang out chill uh next is starting line see ya Fuck, fuck, fuck! Get up! With a dumb move. Ugh. Get up! Ugh. Ugh. Dumb move! Let's go! Let's go, let's go! Damn it! Right into the tree! Come on now! Come on now! Where are we going here? Oh, god damn it. Oh, the roots got me on that one. 
This is pathetic, man. are soft uh, you saw you saw me when I got in front of you yeah. I, ha I had zero control I can't I couldn't even I couldn't even reel you in bro so don't push it then this is rough I'm not I'm not going you realize what's happening now right I don't care there's a dog collar in your future I don't care <laughs> I don't care all the way up to eight huh? right now dude I'll tell you what I'll make a deal with you test five, I'll only put it on seven. Uh-uh, I'll take full juice, not to, I can't. Is that messed up for me? That's okay. Bro, I literally, you saw me. Oh yeah, I, I thought mean, you went in a ditch. I wonder why, what happened, you just smoked? I just got completely tired. Then you passed me, and then you were like, squidding out. I know, and I was like, just go, man. And you're like, no, go. I'm like, JB, I yeah. cannot go anywhere right now. Come on, here's a second. This nah. one's 9.2. And then a and then a 10 miler after that. I'm done after this. Uh, that, was, uh, that was section three. I got it right here. 9.2 for this section five. 43. Uh, 53 is our end. 53 miles? Okay. No, yeah. They're gonna give us like fire road for this section, right? I hope so. Yeah, probably. Okay. okay bro. I got enough. Make sure I want a, I want a cold fucking beer when I get back to that trailer. Uh -huh. I'll save you one. <laughs> Better save you one. Go talk to Dalton. Yeah. You know, I'm going to put you on camera too to talk about your quitting. All right. Don't drink all my beers. No. See, this is the worst part. <laughs> I'm going to be I'm gonna be shamed, verbally abused. <laughs> Wait, a long that's ride home. It, that's a long ride home, motherfucker. That's a long ride home. Can I, can I make it one more test? It's a longer ride home when you're injured, though. Yeah, see? Thank you. Okay. Oh. Okay. It is exactly, oh, what time is it? 2.10. I just got sat down probably five minutes ago. I got done with test four. Test one, two, three, and four. 
I started riding at 945 to get to get to ready to ride. So I've been on the bike since 945. Haven't stopped. I was late in section two, beginning of section two by two minutes. Then I was late in section four because I was on time in three, but late in section four because I had to come and get gas. I didn't have a pit crew waiting for me at the finish or that check of end of three. But anyway, I had to come here and get gas. At least Matthew Braddy did put my gas cap on. That was a big help. Anyway, uh, Gobbler Getter 2023 is in the books. I have no idea how I did. I finished. I didn't get hurt. I didn't kill myself. I made it across all the sketchy bridges that were out there. And there was some stuff out there that could have messed your whole day up. You know, so it's definitely not for the faint of heart, the Gobbler Getter. Because the hill climbs are, they're great, but you, you, you're climbing up. You're going up and then you have to turn. Then you got to turn again. Oh my God. I did mess up on like three uphills. Only one that I have to come back down because there was two other guys up there stuck. And I didn't have enough momentum to try to get around them, and that was stupid on me. But anyway, I don't know. I couldn't even change the battery in the GoPro. I didn't have any time. So this is my little spiel. JB, Chris, and Mac, Frank, are still out there. Um, Frank and Mac, not Frank. JB oh yeah JB Frank Mac only had to do five sections Chris McGuckin had to do six now Frank said he was going to do six to show solidarity then JB said he was going to do them I have no idea if JB's going to do them the odds are probably not but he did write it down on his little cheat sheet of the mileage and then Mac, I don't know, he only has to do five. So anyway, I'm out. Talk to you soon. Bye. So Frank, what's what's going on? Dead tired. Did you do five? Yeah. I did what I had to. That's it. So you're not doing six? I think we're in. Did Chris do five and six? No. Chris pitched out. That's, uh, oh man, we've all, we've already had talks the whole time. Cause guess what? I wanted to quit after three. See, cut off. Mr. A rider over. I know. I know. Man, I wanted to quit so bad. Oh my god. I could have quit off this two laps, dude. I couldn't. I just couldn't. Cause I'll tell you right now, this was some sketchy shit out there. I thought I think it's harder than last year. Because, yeah, because it was one like, couple of progressively worse. Like those hills on the like I figured out uh, 53 is the finish line. Yeah. I'm like, oh, all right. Okay. So I have to turn fucking rock a hill with dirt and loose rocks and all there. And like six, five, six guys in the cameras there. I'm like, oh no. Uh, Are you kidding me, man? So what'd you think about the track? Uh -huh, I, didn't, I, 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 it was harder this year than it was last year. I finished though. Yeah. But I don't know about Chris. This, what happened to Chris? He passed you. Of course, I'll be tested about three minutes in. I don't know what he does. He hauls fucking ass. That's what he does. And he don't stop. Uh, does he stand up or sit down? Oh, a little bit of everything. Yeah. You name it, he's fucking doing it. 
He's standing, sitting, he's jumping. He's got him in B50 plus. So you, huh? He's got him in B50 plus. He's B50 That's plus. Oh, okay. oh God, there's JB. JB looks very clean. JB had a. This one was actually. I had a two minute head right? shirt on JB. You see, Nobody he's right behind me. Yeah. yeah. What is he? Thirty seconds behind me. Yeah, not he much. He smoked me by a minute and a half on every test. So, yeah. hey, what's going on? Tell us about your uh, event. You hit a wall. Physically hit a wall. There's no walls out there. Oh. So, but what happened to Chris? Dude, I think you, I think you beat Rusty Easter. And by the way, he started two minutes late. I saw him. Oh, he did. I just beat him on this. I just beat him on this test. I think you, I think you beat him, dude. You got him. You're ahead of him right now. Really? Yeah. So. You got test dog five it, four in there? Dog call. No, no, listen. Hold on, wow. hold on. Just, 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 just. Because he, he did, he had a four letter word called double T. That's the rule. But we, we me and Dalton, we would, we would talk, right? And we, we definitely have been, uh, we've had the heart to heart. Wait a minute. Did you quit? No, no. no, I didn't quit. But, so, this is, this is what happened. Okay. Dalton has identified him. Whoa, whoa, hold on. Have you ever known me to quit a race? Don't know. Unless I break a leg. Unless you break a leg. There you go. So Dalton identified the problem. It's these non-alcoholic beers are taken from my hydration, right? So I believe that. That's part of my alcoholism, baby. And alcoholism is a disease, right? I'm not sure about that because I have several beers. No, no, no. But th he drinks yeah. these like they're water every day. Right. Yeah, but but how many? You don't. He's drinking. How many beers oh, you drink a day? About a twenty. A twenty. See, before he was drinking Lacroix. Yeah. See, so. And you don't want to shock collar somebody because of their disease, JB. And JB, I talked to him about it. I, I, JB, I told him. I said that's the problem. We are the smartest dumb guys you're ever gonna see. They're all boys. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm mean, gonna have to quit. Here's the deal. I'm gonna quit the non-alcoholics all together. That's double done. Double, nobody likes a quitter. Yeah, oh, I gotta get a shot collar for that too? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna lay down because I am fucking tired. Yeah. Okay. Do you have a sponsor now, Chris? Is that what's happening? Yeah, you're gonna be my sponsor again, baby. You you're firing me as your sponsor? No, I said you're going to be my sponsor. You're going to be a sponsor. Oh, okay. I, I didn't know you I were. I thought you were hiring Dalton for your sponsor there. No, no, I'm, no there's no hiring. Dalton's my lawyer. She's, <laughs> she's arguing the non-shot yeah, yes. I'm trying to help him out. So because. you want to hear the results between you and Cromwell? Yes. What do you, th what do you Is think? Is it already posted? Yeah. Yeah. What do you think? I think it's cl really close. It is. Yeah. Did it get me? How, no, no, just, just say how many seconds in between them. So there is. Uh, let's see. The last two laps he got. The no, last two seconds. Eighty-eight seconds between you two. Wow. Yeah. 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 Wow. So. One, one of you. So tell. So so tell JB, who's ahead. So one of you got one ninety. In eight seconds, okay. 190 minutes, eight seconds, and one of you got 191 minutes and 34 seconds. Oh my God! JV is that lower? So I got him by a minute. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I worked so hard. Hey, use that camera. I worked my ass off trying to catch him. <laughs> Never saw him, but I kept pushing and pushing. Never gave up. And there you go. Hey, hey, You're hey, not a quitter. I'm not a quitter. Not a quitter. Hey, check the last two tests though. So, in the ballpark of a physical injury. So, I mean, what's, what's the what's the what's the prognosis here? What's your defense? What's my defense? Well, I no. This is what happened. All right, he comes in. He's very distraught, distraught okay. over this. So, and I'm ragging on him. He's distraught because he knows he's got a dog collar. Uh, yeah, but no, it's he doesn't like to quit. He's more disappointed. <laughs> and, and so I said, listen, and I said, you need to be working out, but I'm that I'm sitting in my chair. I know, but I, I said, what, what's, what's different? The difference is he's been drinking non-alcoholic beer and drinks them like they're going out of style. So you're going to claim it's about the drink. Yes. It's about the dehydration. See, 
dehydration. I would argue you two are definitely kinetic. Yeah, that's my point. But as a, as a good defense attorney, you have to argue a physical limitation because of the rules. Injury and motor and maintenance are the only two exceptions to the rule. So he has a mental. He has a disease. Yeah, We're all disease. mentally retarded. Yeah, yeah. Everybody has that. But if you claim that dehydration was the that physical limitation, yeah, there we go. That was oh. the physical. <laughs> then, then he gets a pass because it's a physical ailment. Yeah, that, there we go. See, See, you got to learn how to be a lawyer. Yeah. So do you want? Do you want some Guess who? No way. No. Uh, he, I gave him two fucking minutes Listen. on test three. So. so here's the. How did you give him two minutes? So one of you. I started two minutes late. Oh. I showed up late on four. Oh, so here's the thing. One of you. After lunch. One of you completed it in 190 minutes and eight seconds. Okay. The other one completed it in 191 minutes and 34 seconds. 88 seconds. UB. Yeah. All right, so I'm gonna come over and get a beer now. You know? Oh God! Corona Premier Champions. Oh my God! Oh, here's the camera opener. Got a can opener on this damn cooler. Cheers. Cheers. Well deserved. Yep. I waited till y'all got here. Yeah. Oh, we, were hiding, we were hiding your helmet, Tom. Well, so you we were hiding your helmet, so you couldn't get <laughs> Boy, Cromwell's crying. Huh? Letting him believe that. But I showed up late. I showed up late. It's a race, man. It's a race. You got me. You got me. Fair and square. Hey, can you check out a, um, Glenn Chase? Hey, what about Rusty Easter? Yeah, see how he did. What happened with him? He did. Glenn Chase is the other one. He, he started the last test. Glenn, he did. But he was dog shit slow, man. I beat him. Wait, are you saying you beat him on every test? Yeah. Well, you beat him on every test. Oh, I wish I wouldn't have gave up that two minutes, JB. Yeah. Not so much with you, but with Rusty. You guys probably would have been exactly the same. Yeah. Because think about you it. didn't actually wait two minutes. You had like 10, 15 seconds head start. Oh, oh, because you guys didn't go sure for like what? Down. Yeah. Oh. 10 seconds. 10, 10, 10, 15 seconds. So you guys were probably dead. Oh, yeah. my God. It would have been a 10 second. It would have been that much. Five to 10 seconds. seconds less than that is fucking awesome, dude. Yeah, it's good. I'm just glad my back didn't give out. Man, I pr I, di I didn't want to finish. I don't want to do it at all. I, I, was, I was right there with you. But I'm like, no, I'm going to finish. I had to come here, get gas, and I was still late. Yeah, every time. We didn't have any. Guess what? I'm at test four, beginning of test four. My bike fell over to the right. Just fell over. So I pick it back up. It falls over to the left side. And I'm like, well, I guess I'll get on it now. Man, that was embarrassing. I saw that guy that was talking to you on the side of the road. How's it going there, Juan? Two and three. Good. I'm good. I'm doing good. Oh, finished, right? Yeah. Yeah. He did four sections. I did. You know what? Just throw that on the ground. For being, for yeah, being late, I was like ten minutes late. Why were you? Okay, Juan. You had How can you be ten minutes late? Yeah. Well, lunch, that man. is called lunch and you know chill. No, you cannot do this. This is a race. I know, I know. And I talked to Frank. I'm like, you guys are going? Yeah, we're going. I'm like, whatever. The Frank. Cetra is a crew. It was dual. Yeah, Cetra was dual. Yeah. Oh, is it? Yeah. It's a dual. Yeah. Are you a member of Cetra? Oh. Doesn't matter. Okay. Hey, race is over. That's why I'm Test five is over anyway. Back at camp. I barely made it. I was dying. Was cramping. It was miserable. I was slow. I just wanted for it to be over. Wasn't having fun in the last test. But 
We're here. Everybody's here. Christopher's here. More to follow on this guy. Frank's back. He whipped everybody's ass. Juan's over there, thumb gas. There's Mac, he's done. And there's Big D, because Big D finished early. Now we're hanging, having our beers, and talking about the lies about who did what, who did not. We're all still here. Max pulling this titty tape off. I'm exhausted. So we're gonna pack up slowly. It is, what time is it? Um, what time you got? 3.38. So probably out of here by 4.30, probably at the best, and then we'll roll back to the hotel. And then uh, at some point, I'll, I'll look at the video footage and see if it's worth a shit. And we'll go from there. Oh, that's, that's it. You want to tell them what happened? That fourth, uh, 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 test. Do you want to tell them what happened? It's okay. Oh, it's, it's okay. So it's it so slow. Yeah. Step, right? I'm gonna. I'll go on record and say that he has a physical ailment, which is what his lawyer is arguing. So with a physical ailment, it falls in the category of injury. So the dog collar punishment may or may not be applied. I gotta be real. The problem is he's a team captain, so we need an adjudicator. So we might have to take the whole team as an adjudicator, write the story up, present the story. Oh, they're all gonna vote. Shock me, dude. That's, that's up to you. <laughs> your team. Your team. Yeah, they will vote to shock me. Your team, not everybody else. Yeah, we, don't, we don't have to deal with the we got, You got four of your team right here. So, okay, yeah. Right, yeah. Majority so, rules. Majority so rules. So we'll put it to a vote once he officially, you know, comes up with a, a story that makes sense. <laughs> exactly. Am I still a prospect? And then we'll, and then we'll figure out whether or not he qualifies for the dog call. But everybody finished. Uh, Frank was by far the, the stellar star today. He was uh, consistent like he always is. Mac, um, Mac was pushing. Now, interesting thing between Mac and I. So, officially, I beat him by, what was it, 88 seconds? Yeah. Beat him by 88 seconds, right? So that is what, a minute and, what's my math, 22 seconds. However, after lunch, he started late. We don't exactly know what time he started late. In fact, we probably can look it up to see what time he started, but I, I don't know. Because we feel like he started a couple of minutes late because he started just before we did. He was on row 101, we were on row 103. He rolled up there last second. I want a beer. Hey, brew, beer, please, thank you. So, so think about it. So if I beat him officially by uh, 88 seconds, but he started late on one of the tests, he's coughing up a lung, by two minutes, well then he would have beaten me. So we'll see. We're going to run some math on the way home, I'm sure, and then figure it out. But uh, either way, we're running... We are running exactly the same speed, which is awesome, and we're having fun chasing each other. I had fun chasing him down. Okay. Enough bullshit. We are uh, going to drink a couple more beers here, relax, load up, hit the hotel, and tomorrow morning, you know, oh dark 30, we are on the road back to Florida. Enjoy. I'm going to try and... I know, I didn't. We'll see. I, didn't have to I don't know. It was fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's always so fun. Thank you to I the Perry Mountain Motorcycle Club for sure for putting this side. thing on. Oh, super, super appreciated. Oh, it fucking did. Right on All right, me. bye. Because I got the